Dog, we raised the roof up. A yeah. <laughs> hey, man, but we got to hurry up, because I just made reservations for three. Me, Officer Barry, and her handcuffs. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, bro, can you open this? No, sit down. Jello in 10 minutes. <laughs> no, see, we ain't patients here. We just did the show. We the soul teacher. Oh, yeah? Well, she's Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> that brother wearing a banana skirt, he's Josephine Baker. <laughs> I'm Sherman the guard. And you two ain't going nowhere. <laughs> Break him off a piece of that funk. <laughs> <laughs> Dog, aren't you gonna eat your jello? It's got fruit in it. Shit. How you standing there stuffing your mouth like a snacking Bill Cosby? <laughs> Maybe you belong here. Hold on now, dog. What you mad at me for? You don't want to let Regina talk you into anything. Okay, and what's that supposed to mean? Oh no, so much hostility. <laughs> I did something wrong, didn't I? Sarah, this isn't about you or your paranoia. They're obviously conflicted over a deep-seated emotional issue. I should know. I went through the same thing with my brother, Dwight Eisenhower. <laughs> He's the one with emotional issues. You know, he going through some kind of crazy little midlife crisis. You know, his music career is in the toilet, and the only woman that he's ever really loved is about to marry Jordan Maddox. You expect her to leave Jordan Maddox, a famous basketball star, for you? And they call us delusional. <laughs> What'd I say? Listen, why don't you people go back to finger painting or airbrushing or whatever y'all do without sharp objects? Steve, you may not have noticed, but I'm paranoid. And what was that? <laughs> anyway, it helps when I talk about my feelings. You should try it. <laughs> Look, lady, the day that I start pouring my troubles out to the Prozac Nation <laughs> is the day I check myself in here. Well, I guess I was mildly attracted to Regina in the past, but, you know, just kind of lost interest, you know. Woman was sending too many mixed signals. Just ain't know what the woman wanted. Mixed signals? For the last four years, The woman and did everything but leave a trail of breadcrumbs to her bedroom. See, do you mind? This is my session. <laughs> see that? See how cranky he is? You ought to seen him the other day when my wife made a few changes around the apartment, which is our home to. Displacement, I had that. Change can be scary, especially quarters. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't mind if LaVita was decorating, but if she's using stuff from the 99 cent outlet store. Steve, let me say this before they strap me to my bed. You have to learn to express your true feelings and not lash out. And you can start with Regina. That's it. You people cannot seem to be getting it through your heads that I could care less if my Regina was getting married. Excuse me, Steve. But do you realize you said my Regina? Uh-huh. Yeah, it is. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, guess I could start being a little more honest with people. Could start with myself. <laughs> I'm 40, and I hate it. You know, that wasn't so hard, was it? Now, is there something you want to say to your friend? Well, I guess. Say it. Vita has every right to try to make the apartment feel like you all's home, too. I guess I'm just feeling a little displaced. But then that's my problem. I'm sorry about that, dog. Sorry. All right. I'm sorry too, dog. I guess that painting of the Last Supper with all the dead rappers on it ain't for everybody. <laughs> Don't worry, we're working on moving out. <laughs>